Happy Pride. This year's Pride celebration in San Francisco has been amplified after the California Supreme Court struck down the gay marriage ban. With so many same-sex couples flooding county clerk's offices throughout the state, this year's Pride celebration has a record of newlywed gay brides and grooms. And many with kids. And without further ado, the San Francisco LGBT Pride Parade Celebration, united by pride, bound for equality. decision that we had a pretty lousy yeah. one in the U.S. Supreme Court, but obviously yeah. today we're going to celebrate. Uh, nothing more remarkable than the idea that we're all treated the same, yeah. and that we should all expect uh, that the full promise of the Constitution is to everybody, regardless of race, ethnicity, and regardless of sexual orientation. Uh, and that's what freedom's all about, uh, the right to be treated equally. And that's what we're celebrating. Thank you so much. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed our annual Pride edition of Outlook Video. Outlook Video is made possible by generous support from viewers like you. Thank you for your support, and thanks for watching. Be sure to tune in next, next month for our wrap of the annual San Francisco International LGBT Film Festival with Raymond Donald Hall. For all of us here at Outlook Video, Happy, happy Pride! Pride.
remember my very first march and my first pride parade. I was just coming out. I was very shy about it. And I remember I just turning onto Market Street and being hit with a wall of cheers just going up Market Street in between all those buildings. And we've gone back and talked to uh, original band members and they've all had that same experience. You can talk to these tough guys who, you know, in their 60s and they will talk about that first parade in 1978 and start crying and um, because it meant so much just that level of pride and acceptance and then of course uh, tomorrow is the big parade that's really D-Day for our 30th anniversary and we're going to be wearing the original uniforms that the band wore way back 30 years ago so that's pretty exciting.